All right, everybody, Jared with Second Life Design. Uh, I'm gonna be installing some threaded inserts in my slab table. I don't know if you can see these. These are brass. Um, these are quarter 20s. You can get these in a variety of different sizes, pitches, whatever. So what I'm doing in, is installing these into my slab for these table legs. Let me pitch my camera up here. You can kind of get an idea of it. This is my big slab table. I'm putting these legs in the bottom of it. So it might be a little overkill, but I, Maybe moving this table at some point, it'd be a lot easier to do with these these uh, bolts. You just go in and out of it. So what I've taken already is my center punch and indicated where I want my holes at. I center punch those, so they are in there. I'm going to install these two tonight. We're going to do this kind of in real time, so you can see how quick and easy this is. Uh, it's not a hard process. Uh, it's kind of like installing a helicoil. If anyone's a mechanic, they would know what that is, or a machinist. Uh, I've got my blocks here. I use these for spacing. Uh, so I can get my bracket straight, but my holes are marked where I want them. So I'm going to slide my bracket forward just a little bit, and we're going to drill some starter holes. So this isn't any standard size, this is just a starter hole, nothing special about this. So, if I can get a close up on this, what I've done, I've taken this, the actual drill bit required and I took my stop collar from my Craig jig and put it around here. So what that's going to do is going to stop it from going in too deep. Uh, a lot of people have seen this where they will put electrical tape around it, something like that. Uh, this gives me a little bit better positive reinforcement of it. So, let me grab one of these. So it, you can see I'm going just a little bit deeper than what the depth of my insert. So that's how that's gonna work. So I'll go a little bit more, so we have a little more room to work with. My drill bit installed. We will hog these guys out. Two large holes installed. It goes to installing these guys. There is a special driver for each one. This is a, you can kind of see this one, nothing too special about it. Uh, chucked into my impact driver. these dudes in. Drive it down until she's flush. And we are home. Looks awesome. Small batteries. Last one installed. And that is it. Really nice finished, finished result. Um, sorry for little, the clunkiness on this video. I wanted to do this in real time. I wanted to kind of illustrate that it's not a big time intensive process to install these. Um, you break these down by cost. They are about 30 cents a piece for install. 
uh, for the actual insert. So it's they, they can add up, but it, to me, it's the ease of it's a little bit better. Um, I just I want to go with a little bit different kind of finish for these. So that's what we went with. All right, guys, appreciate following along.